Hi, I'm Heather Cooper, Manager Teaching and Research Services at Macquarie University Library. This talk focuses on the development of our guide, AI Powered Tools for Literature Reviews. Around 2022, we became aware that literature searching was changing. Finding keywords and developing a perfect search using Boolean was moving on. Artificial intelligence was enabling research processes to develop where searching large data sets could be done with increased efficiency. How this works varies from tool to tool. In Research Rabbit, searching can be done using a seed paper. The content of the seed paper is used to search for similar papers. You can also use visualization tools to see how papers are connected. Another tool, Cite, provides a unique search via citation statement or publication searching. Results indicate the citation context, where the location of the citation within a paper implies its value. The tool Elicit enables you to enter a question. It then searches for papers and returns the top papers with an abstract summary. It can pull key information into a research matrix. For now, what makes up these tools is mostly open source content. However, the makers of sites suggest they've made agreements with publishers to use their content. Why should we care about this new way of literature searching? We knew these tools were here to stay and evolving. We also knew we had some academics teaching our postgrads how to use these tools. Teaching literature searching has long been a part of our role as librarians, so we felt a need to keep up to date with this changing landscape. We needed to know and understand this new space and feel confident to share this knowledge. We decided to develop a guide to record what we knew and what we were learning. We felt that all our students needed to know about these new tools, not just fortunate students who had a tutor switched on to this change. Hi, I'm Jing Li, Coordinator of Teaching and Research Services at the Macquarie University Library. In late 2023, a study guide was published to assist the Macquarie researchers in finding, evaluating, and using AI tools, including generative AI, effectively throughout the literature review process. The guide includes the following sections. Overview of AI-powered tools, commonly used for literature reviews and their operations. A comparison of the functionalities of these tools. Important points to consider when utilizing these tools for research, including advantages, risks, and ethical considerations. Guidelines on referencing generative AI technology in research and the Macquarie University's standards. In early 2024, the faculty librarians and I started offering workshops and consultations on using AI-powered tools for research, especially for literature reviews, to research students in the Faculty of Science and Engineering. Academics and students welcomed the workshops, and as a result, we received increasing requests from subject conveners and research supervisors. For the next stage, we will investigate case studies in different research disciplines and consider extending the workshops to more faculties. As AI technologies evolve quickly, and some academic resource providers offer AI-assisted searching functionalities on their platforms, like Scopus AI, we will monitor the latest developments and update the study guides and the training materials constantly. Our goal is to guide Macquarie researchers to use AI technologies to optimize their research processes in a responsible and ethical way. Thank you for watching.